We're back here on the now, and boy, in this job, you know, you think at this point in your career, you think you've seen every single story uh, that could come your way, and you think you might have a handle on how sad it can get sometime, and then one just hits you and it really surprises you. This next story is that kind of story. A mom and dad suffered a horrible loss this past weekend. Their 11-year-old son died from complications due to a nut allergy. So how are they dealing with this tragedy today? Well, they're actually taking some decisive action. The Nails Alana Quillen is joining us here in studio with their heartbreaking story, but very oh, yeah. inspirational to all of us, too. Oh, of course. Now, Shannon, it all happened so fast. Oakley Debs went to the hospital last Wednesday. On Thanksgiving Day, he was on life support. On Saturday, he was gone. And today, his mom told me that the family is starting a foundation in her son's memory to raise awareness for nut allergies. And that's an incredible woman. He's my little rock star. And 11-year-old Oakley Debs rocked it on the soccer field. He loved to play soccer more than anything else. He loved sports. He wanted to be a quarterback. His, his main idol in life was Eli Manning. But Oakley struggled with severe nut allergies his entire life. He always checked the labels. He was always very aware of nuts and any foods. During a Thanksgiving family vacation, Oakley accidentally ingested cake containing nut resin. And he said to me, Mommy, I think I just ate a nut. Oakley went into anaphylactic shock. With seizures and cardiac arrest and blue, and he died in my husband's arms. Just days after such a heartbreak, Oakley's family is taking action. They're creating the Red Sneaker Foundation in their son's memory. And every sport that he ever played, his shoe always had to be red. The first step is to ask people to wear red sneakers this week. The goal, to have those red sneakers someday represent the dangers of nut allergies nationwide. The rest of my life is going to be filled with this loss. I need to think about this loss. I need to make it positive. I need to channel it into something so that the world or the community, the country will understand what a peanut allergy is. That if we continue this advocacy of his red sneakers, we'll keep his, his shining light alive because he deserved it. Oakley leaves behind a twin sister. Olivia now wears his favorite red sneakers. Because I know that he's with me. I know that he's right next to me right now. And now, the, as you could see, a lot of the children were there, his friends, they were supporting the family, spending a lot of time with them. But there will be a soccer benefit tournament on Saturday, December 10th. His family is encouraging kids of all ages to come out and play and, of course, to wear some red sneakers. We'll have some more information posted on our website after the show, WPTV.com. Shannon. You're right. That mom, mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, she is incredible. Mm -hmm. Just a few days after her little guy's death, I am just oh, so brokenhearted over that story. Alana, thank you for doing it justice. You did a great job. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you.